Hi everyone, welcome back to another video. In this video, guys, I'm going to show you how to fix can't add card to Apple Pay. So if you're not able to add your card in Apple Pay, then I'm going to show you how you can fix this problem. So the first step is make sure that you have a working internet connection or cellular data. For that, you can also go to YouTube and make sure that your internet connection is working. So once you have made sure that your internet connection is working, then the next step is check Apple Pay status. If it's the if Apple Pay service is down, you will not be able to add the card. You can search for Apple system status. Then just simply open the first page. And as you can see, all services are operating normally. Also, you can see Apple Cash and there will be Apple Pay and Wallet available. So that means Apple service is operating normally. Now move on to the next step. So if you are not able to add your card, you have to contact your bank. Come back doesn't allow online purchasing. So you have to normally call them and ask them to activate online purchasing. So make sure that you contact your bank. And the next step is you have to update your device. For that, go to setting. Then click on general, click on software update. And if there is any software update, make sure that you download and install that update in your iPhone. It can fix your problem. So once you have done this and it's still not working, then go to your wallet app and if you have added any card, you can simply delete the extra card and add the other one. Also, you can go to setting to delete the card. Select the wallet in Apple Pay. Make sure that you delete the card from here and add the card again. And if it's still not working, then the next step is check your iPhone region. For that, click on general. Then click on language and region and click on region so if you're living in the native state or uk and you have selected another country you have to select that country and also make sure that apple pay works in your country next step is go to settings and disable the vpn so if you have added any vpn then go to vpn and device management click on vpn click on icon and delete the vpn so once you have done this and if it's still not working then the next step is you have to factory default your iphone with this method you will lose all of your data so make sure that you have a backup of your data so you can restore later so hope this video helped you if it does then leave a like and comment thanks for watching